well once again the right house team manager Len Silver playing uh, what he hopes will be a bit of a joker here this is Kevin Smith coming into heat number 12 which is an ultimate race you can see this Groveway Stadium really set in the quite picturesque Buckinghamshire countryside which is the crowd gather under us it looks a bit sparse don't believe it there's a goodly crowd here this evening Heat 12, Milton Kings, two up, two races to go. Bob Humphrey's the rider on the inside in red. We covered after a disastrous first race. He's got a second and a win after that. Next to him in grid two, those long legs sticking out, Bobby Garrett in yellow and black. Grid three has David Ashby, very steady, two thirds and a second so far. And on the outside, Kevin Smith. A win, a second and two thirds in the reserve berth for Rye House Rockets. Heat 12. from the inside and Smith from the outside and Smith who beat Humphreys earlier on gets around the outside again or does he? Shoulder to shoulder Humphreys the last to shut off he leads it second place Smith and third place it's Garrett and at the back it is David Ashby there they come hurtling into our camera here on the pit corner at Groveway Stadium and it's getting pretty close there isn't a lot to choose between first and last here Smith, very spectacular there, almost uh, lost it again on that bottom corner, and Humphreys is in trouble. Humphreys has packed up, and that is a tragedy for Milton Keynes. We just got a glimpse of him there, the point gave up the ghost. Roy House step in to first and second places, and that really is disaster for the Knights. Oh dear, oh, whoa, oh my. Milton Keynes having recovered from being six points down, having grabbed a two-point lead, now look as though they have thrown it away through Bob Humphrey's bike, and they're going into the bottom corner, Smith is in trouble, and Smith has hit the fence down there, and it looks as though he was in trouble as well, the bike really must have given up, he seemed to lose his steering, there's Kevin Smith, the drama continues to pile up here at Groveway, we wonder what can possibly happen next, Smith has ripped his leathers there, but uh, he's going to pick up his bike to push it home, but in fact, it's not going to work, Kevin, because the track staff, uh, one of the track staff, in fact, helped to bike up there. I don't think it can possibly work. The rules clearly state a rider can push on if he has been unassisted. But unless we were terribly wrong, it looked as though a track staff man picked the bike up. So I don't think that point's going to count. Yeah.